found a whole shoe store. Now are we gonna find a whole jewelry store? Look at this stuff, guys. Cops here again on day two. Crazy. I'm gonna peek around the corner real quick because that is the third cop I seen come from back here already. No cops down there. Dang. Just figured out why the police were here. I bought a shoe store and they got robbed. Just bought a storage, 1500 bucks. Little concerned, we are in one of the most roughest cities in California. And I'm hoping to find a diamond in the rough, but I'm gonna let you guys see what we purchased, 1500 bucks. And this thing looks good. Oh, let me show you. Here it is. Could have been a pure gamble, but I'm getting the vibe that it was a store of some sort, woman's shoes. Oh, enough baby. of me talking, enough of the big guy on the screen. Let's hope we find this diamond in the rough, guys, in here. Let's do it. First, let's start off moving these lovely women out the way. Okay, I feel a little weird. Why'd I do that? Let's move these out the way. We got one, two, three, four mannequins. Well, four mannequins. I don't see the top half. It could be in there still. But this looks like the thing they stand on. And then this looks like the little seat you sit on when you change your shoes. Oh, baby, let this be a shoe store. Woman's shoes. Flat gray pink shoes. Let's see, baby. If they just wrote it on there. If that's... Oh, 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 oh. Uh-oh, we might be into some business, guys. Ooh, nice little flats. Them look like five, ten bucks all day right there. Let's see what else we got. What are these? Oh, little high heels. New high heels at that. Oh, wow, we're going to have a lot of... Sh oh, look at those. Oh, if every box is filled with shoes like this... This is gonna be a really good lock. Oh my gosh, look at when I moved the one box. Look at this, guys. Oh man, all the way down. Just different high heel. Oh, those are eating up. I hope they're all not like that. <laughs> Let's just hope that one pair is like that. Let's see. Let's see, come on, please don't be falling apart. Ah, just a little bit. Look how long these have been sitting. Let's try these flats right here and see what we got. Oh, those are cool. Ooh, so the whole box, probably at least 30 pairs in there. If they're all kind of messed up how that one was, we might be in danger, but still probably get two, three bucks. Look at all the boxes in here. Let's keep it going. Look how long this box been sitting. Sitting so long that the tape wasn't even took off. It just got dust in there. But it says on it, Right here, boys' tennis shoes, white and blue. What kind of tennis shoes? Oh, ooh. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Look, come on. Come on. I'm seeing fives and tens, babies. All day. Those are nice little kid shoes. Another one's, oh, it's all the way down, little kid shoes. I think it was a store. Oh, I should donate these. Look at that. Nice little shoe. How many pairs are we gonna have in here? This one box right here? It's probably gonna be at least what? Let me see, let me move two boxes. See, we got all the way down, baby, shoes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight on top, so 16 pairs in this one box. Oh, come on, baby, let's keep it going like this. Long boots for women, black and brown. Are these gonna be thigh highs? Wait, the longs crossed out right there. Yes, I know about thigh high, guys. Uh, a wife and plenty of sisters. Let's see what we got here. Oh, they look like the boots that were in the other one, the white ones. Hmm, what do we have here? Be good ones. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Look at those high heels, long. There's probably one of them, what they are right here. Another one. These are in good shape, 41 bucks. 
Holy crap, I'll take five all day. Look at that one's peeling a little bit on the back. Oh, I hope they're all not like that. Maybe just that one because it was out of it. But look, we got probably one, two, three, about 20 pairs of shoes in that box. Fragile. Or fragile. Oh, they probably were selling these shoes at the flea market. A little, little pieces in here. Probably put them in this little net. Uh, a little cheap uh, flea market items. Where's those at? Ooh, hopefully we find some old toys in here. Transformers. Where's that at? Flea market stuff. So. Still sells. Good money. Look at this one. I just opened. School rides. Let's see what kind of shoes these are. Okay, them little dressy black shoes. What's that? A, how many pairs you think are in here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All the way down. Oh, wait, there's a different type of shoe down there. Oh, those are thigh highs. Let's pull one out to show you guys real quick. All right. It's a long box. Hey, girl, what's your name? Rose Wild. Wow. Hey, hey, hey. What do you have to say? Those things is peeling if you scratch them. Those are pretty nice though. There's what? One, two, three, four, five. So that whole box right there is like another 15 pairs of shoes. Um, Look what this box says. Jackie Chan style man shoe black. Man shoes black. Okay. What we got here? Open it, open it. What? You can't tell me I ain't gonna be able to average five bucks a pair for these. Oh, they're Jackson Jackie Chan. Did Jackie Chan make shoes? Those are actually pretty nice. And we're all the way down to the bottom. There's a couple pairs of the, the kids' to shoes down here. But for the most part, these look like all men's shoes in this box. Look at those. Nice. Nice. Nice, baby. I'm seeing money coming from everywhere. Okay, what kind of shoes are these? Bumpers? Oh, those are nice. They got a price tag of $17.99, but I'll probably sell them for five bucks. And this boxes are little, which means that there's probably like 40 boxes of shoes in here. Oh, wait, they're not all the same. Did I record this box already? Or am I just uh, deja vu from the ones I just seen? Don't know. But anyway, these are a little nicer. A lot of flats. That's good. All right, we got a duct taped box. I think I underestimated the quant quantity, not quality, guys, quantity of shoes that are going to be in here if they're all shoes. Because these are all the same boxes. And the first, what? How many boxes did I put in there? Maybe five? We're all shoes. And this looks like there's another 40 shoe boxes in here. Dang, do the math. If we have a total of, say, 1,000 pair, 1,500 pairs of shoes, we average five bucks a shoe. That's like five grand off of my $1,500 purchase. But you know what? I think I might know someone that'll buy all these at once. Look at that. All the way down. Shoes, shoes, shoes. Ooh, those are a little better, too. All day, five, ten bucks for these. I got to get these off, though, because it is winter now, but it's California, baby. It'll be summer in no time. But look at how many we have. Splash. Let's see if there are the same ones on the next one. Let's see, baby. What do we got here? Splash. Same one. Dang, there's a good 20 boxes of those in there. 10 bucks a piece on them. Come on, baby. I'm starting to think we did find that diamond in the rough. Let's make it happen. And we have been at it. This is what we have left. Couple boxes, but I'm pretty sure... They all say the same. See, uh, brown woman's heel. These are uh, hills. Something else. Luna. I don't know what color that is in Spanish. These are something brown. Quantity of nine. More sandals. This one says something else than that. And that one says shoes. And this one's blank. Let's open these three and see what we got in them. 
And the box that says shoes, you guessed it, more shoes. These are a little nicer though. Some little boots, more shoes, more money. Imagine if every box was just packed with Jordans or Nikes or even just some type of name brand. They'd have been crazy good. All right, last box in here. Let's see what we got. Sorry, guys, I'm one-handed. So you guys got to deal with me. Well, I uh, manhandle this box. Uh, and more shoes. And that's no surprise. More shoes, nothing special. Just a little high heel, baby. All right. So this box said, what was it, tool on the other end? But honestly, look at this, guys. Ho, 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 baby. Can you say jewelry? Jewel wire making. Beautiful wire jewelry. Oh, look at the little clamps. Where's the gold at here? These are actually very nice, though. These are very nice. So, excuse my hands, they're real dirty. Been working all day. No gold, no nothing like that, but this is still gonna be a couple dollars. Little earrings and stuff. Let's get back into this box. Oh, baby. Ooh, ooh, jewelry. Oh, man. Can you imagine finding a whole store of jewelry? Let's see what we got here. It looks to me like just some beads. A little gumball looking one. Yeah, nothing major, just some. Looks like they were making the wire jewelry. Might be a little piece of gold in here, maybe. That'd be nice to find, but, oh, a dime. I'm looking for a dime. That's top of the line, slim waist. Okay, I can't see that on there. What's in here? N another pair of shoes, go figure. Hangers, brand new thing of hangers. Might have to take that home. Some paints and an extension cord. Yeah, something different, that was cool. Boots for women, gray, brown, and black. All right, let's see. Are they boots for women? Oh, man. Hope you guys don't get tired of seeing all these shoes because we are going to... Oh, yes, it is. We are going to keep going. I think these ones that are out the box are display. But look at those. Look at that. Boom. Brand new boot. Five, ten bucks all day on these things. I can't call me at the market and get rid of these. Jeep. Oh, those are a little nicer. Oh, wait, hold up. Wait a minute. Little mama might be dipping some of these. Nice. Boxes of shoes, guys. This one says Little Angel. Is that brown quantity 10 and red quantity 12? Little Angels. Oh, Little Angels is the name of the shoes. Oh, look at those guys. That was cute. All day, five, ten bucks on these ones. Those are red, and I'm guessing one of these are going to be the brown. Let's see. Red, red, and brown. There they go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. All day, five bucks on them, do you think? All day, and there's what? Ten, oh, the box said, matter of fact. 10, 10 brown, and 22 pairs of shoes. Five bucks a pair. What is that? 20, dang. That's money, baby. That's what that is, money. So this box was a little bit heavier. Sorry for my my knife, guys. It's the only one I got. Probably feel like, what the heck is he cutting it with? Straight razor blade. But this box felt a little bit heavier than the other ones. So let's hope that it is. Probably gonna be work boots, if anything, because they're heavier. See what we got, baby. Oh, it was heavier for what reason? Hmm, why were you heavier, box? Looks like regular shoes, maybe. Hunter. Shoes and boots. Oh, just shoes. Maybe it's heavier because there's so many of them in there. Like, this thing is packed down. Look at these. Let's see what we got here. Oh, little high heels. That's pretty nice. And just all the way down. Shoes. These are nice. There's probably a couple, at least 50, 60 pairs of 
brand new jeans in there. Jeans sell all day for five bucks a pair. All day. And look at that. They go down, down, down. It's on the bottom. Oh, darker jeans. All the way down. Jeans. That's probably like easy at two, three hundred dollar box. So get a look at these. These are actually pretty nice. I would actually take some of these home for my daughter. All my daughters. Well, the older ones ain't gonna wear it. But a couple pairs of them and then more of the boots back on the bottom. We touching money, guys. And there goes a familiar brand. Bear Paw. Look at these guys. Men's shoes. Nice. Nice. Oh man. A couple hundred pairs of these. Awesome. Would be awesome if we find a couple hundred pairs of these. But I might be dipping me a pair of them. What we got right here? Alpha A. I think these are them white shoes. Them all white ones. Let's see if that's right. Oh no, what are those? What? Crazy. Just found another box of bear claws. I think altogether I probably found like a maybe a hundred or two pairs of these. Maybe a hundred or more pairs of these, but these are pretty cool. And these barely a sixteen dollar tag, but that's for when. Don't know when they did that, but these will be selling at the market. I sell these all day for 10 bucks. All day. And they sell. I think Bear Claw might have went up. And in this box right here, look, we got like the other high heels and stuff I wasn't really feeling, but these right here look a little better than the other high heels. These are like the little flippity flop things, flip flops. And then look at that, more bear claws. Well, the bear claws all the way back right here. Let's take a look in there, guys. Ah. Yep, all the way back. More sandals. Cool. This box, this box says Playboy jeans slash shirts. I'm hoping that it's Playboy brand and not the actual Playboy magazines. Oh, look at Playboy. Wow. Look at that. You know what? This Some of this stuff could be very pricey, like the shirts. Oh, let there be vintage Playboy shirts in here. Nice shirts. Oh, baby. And Playboy jeans, too. Let's see. Are they Playboy? Hmm. Love hangers. Yeah, Playboy. Wow. We got jeans, shirts, Playboy shirts all the way down. Playboy. Wow, that's actually kind of good right there, guys. A bunch of them. $13.99 price tag, but they're older now. So they could be worth way more now. I love it. Angels, anybody? Got a couple hundred <laughs> angels probably now. These look like flea market items. Like they had were selling at the flea market. I thought maybe it'd have been like a retail store, but now I'm starting to see things like this which you sell at a flea market. But that's still good. Sweat suits. Sweat suits, sweat outfits. Nice. Little sweater, top heavy. Ooh, that's not a sweat suit. What is that? John Cena. That's tight. Oh man, I hope I find some more stuff like that. That is actually very cool. We got a cross, sweatshirt, sweatshirt. All oh, those are plain, all oh, just plain black sweatsuits. All the way down though, baby, that's good. These guys are a little bigger. This one came out of the blue box. That was the regular angels right there. And then we got boxes of these blue ones phone in there but boxes tons of these little guys right here i don't know what these things go for probably one or two dollars maybe probably end up selling the whole bundle to someone for cheap hmm. man this facility really is crazy cops here again on day two crazy <sighs> another cop leaving that's like two cops in the one day. Then there was, uh, what was it, two cops the first day I came. This storage facility is, it's a little crazy, but hey. 
and cop number four pulling out. Where are all these guys coming from? I'm gonna peek around the corner real quick because that is the third cop I've seen come from back here already. No cops down there. Dang, I wonder what they're doing. Just figured out why the police were here. I bought a shoe store and they got robbed. Robbed blind. They had a five by five. It was two people in the office and I'm talking to them. I'm like, uh, what happened? They said that someone broke into their five by five and wiped them clean. He said he had collectible shoes. He said he had a couple uh very, very rare posters. I don't know. And he said that they took like everything, every last thing, even the lock that they had. So they broke the lock and took it. He was mad. And then people only paid for, I think it was uh, the lowest, lowest insurance, which only covers 2000. I'm like, dude, that's probably not even what them shoes were worth you had in there. And I guess he said he had some some shoes. I was talking to the manager lady here. She was like, yeah, they had some shoes or something else in there, but they ended up getting robbed blind. That is crazy. Three cops. This place is just, it's, well, it's where we're at. And you know what? I don't mind. Whatever. It's a business. You buy some at some good places. You buy some at some bad places. But look at this. Like, no lie. This is really happening now. <sighs> Why? Oh my God. Crazy. The plan is, Tomorrow, I'll pull up to the flea market, put out maybe 10, 15, okay, probably 50 tables, lay them out, and let you guys get a closer look. If we find some nice Jordans or something crazy in here, I'm going to show you. But I doubt we're going to feel like this is going to be more shoes. This is the type of unit that you would, I would call personally, turn and burn. Bought it for X amount of dollars. If I'm able to sell all these, paid $1,500 for the unit. If I could sell this whole thing for around five grand, I would do it. Quick, boom, get it out of here. Got to go. But next scene. Flea market. Let's get you there. There he is. While the rest of the world is working, this is what he does. Look at this. See this? We're all working, and this guy's taking a nap. Just like that at the flea market. And we are literally like one minute away from where I bought the unit with all the shoes. We have been selling them. I've been giving people super deals, five bucks a pair. Some are messed up, some are nice. I'll give you guys a quick look at some of the stuff we got. Boots, shoes, 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 flip flops, boxes of shoes. What we've been doing is taking one pair out, putting it up top, leaving it, then go through it. Shoes, found a couple pairs of bear claws, nice. More shoes, there's just a lot of shoes. This guy's gonna put these red ones on right here. Go ahead, put them on, see what they look like. <laughs> Lots of shoes, guys. Will I make money out this unit? Probably. Be a slow grind. Choose and fuse to equal up to my money back. Sold a couple boxes, 100 bucks here, 100 bucks there, but it's gonna be money. It's gonna be money. I think it was worth the gamble. I was hoping for new clothes and stuff like that, but it was shoes. Can't be mad at it. I like it. I wish there were nicer shoes. I wish the glue on something wasn't coming apart, but can't always be perfect. Anyway, thank you guys for being here. Appreciate you guys being here. Appreciate the support. We're almost at 100,000. Face red, sun out. Got to get back to work. Peace out.